In this screencast, we're going to talk about using MessagePub with curl. Curl is a command line tool for transferring files with URL syntax. It is a good tool for simulating a user's actions at a web browser. On the documentation tab on MessagePub, you can click on API reference to see the four basic methods of the MessagePub REST API, sending a notification, getting information on one or many of your notifications, and fetching replies. On this page, you can also see that we have many curl examples, and I'm going to run through these examples in a terminal window. First, let's send a notification. I'm posting XML to notifications XML on MessagePub. In return, I'll receive the same XML back, but with an ID and the schedule for sending the notifications in the send nat row for each recipient. You can also see a row for status for each recipient that shows the current status for your notification, sent, scheduled, or otherwise. Now I can get information on the last 50 notifications that I've sent with one GET request to notifications XML. You can see that the notification we just sent comes last as I scroll up and down the many notifications as they're displayed in XML. Next, we can get information back on one particular notification by making a GET request to notifications ID, XML. Replace ID with the ID number of the notification that you're looking for. In this case, I'm getting information on a notification with an ID of 97 that I've sent previously. Finally, you can fetch all your replies by making a GET request to replies XML. In return, you'll receive an array of replies. With every reply, you'll have the notification ID that it's associated with, the actual reply, and how and when the reply was received. In less than two minutes, you, you, you've used curl to send notifications through MessagePub. We said dead simple, and it really is dead simple.